We're going live. Going live. Good evening, everyone. We're going live with a single lens on the Samsung Gear 360. Why do I have this on in my hat? Because I'm somewhat nuts and just having a little fun. Uh, I like wearing masks. I like wearing hats when I do videos. Don't ask why. There is no logical answer. It's just a lot of fun. Anyway, according to tracking, the Xiaomi Mi Sphere 360 from Singapore from Gearbest should be here. Most likely tomorrow since it's at the main office here in Brooklyn. Or the main post office, I should say. So hopefully the next time I shoot some film uh, in 360 or even some stills, they will be in the uh, Xiaomi Mi Sphere. Actually, it's the Mija Mi Sphere 360. Uh, so I'm hoping that the quality will be better. I am shooting this with a single lens because behind my Samsung Gear 360 2017 model, I have my iPad rendering out a 40-ish uh, minute. Oh, crap. I have, uh, <laughs> I just realized, I never put how many minutes the, the gameplay was. It just says minutes of plus of gameplay. Because originally it was 49 minutes, but then I cut out uh, some dead space of uh, Call of Duty, making it much, much less. I think it's down to about 35 minutes now, because I had some headquarters shenanigans in there, and then I played a little war mode. If you uh, are a gamer, you'll probably enjoy Call of Duty uh, Second World War, or World War Two. Anyway. So I'm shooting this with a single lens because right behind it is the light that you see shining on me. As well as my game, my iPad Pro rendering out this video. Okay, so what else is going on? This is going to be a short little jabber. Uh, still using my iPhone SE. And it's letting me with a single lens shoot at. Uh, 1080p I believe or maybe it's 960p actually I think it's 960p because I think it's still in 2 to 1 aspect ratio and it looks like uh, I've got a bit of a fish eye so I may load that into uh, LumaFusion on the iPad later and see if I can defish that look I think the uh, live streaming ability of this camera in single lens mode is probably more useful than the dual lens 360 although it depends where you are I guess if I was in an art gallery 360 would probably be better although I think it only streams on the SE at 720p which is really low resolution or 1280 by 640 something like that so it's it's pretty low res for dual lens. Anyway, I'm just rambling now. Uh, it's going to snow again tomorrow here in New York, which really isn't uh, making me happy. And uh, well, maybe I can get a little closer. Yeah, there we go. It's going to snow a little more tomorrow. It snowed like hell on Thursday. And uh, I don't even know how much snow we got, but my back was killing me. Alrighty, what else is going on? Again, the Mija Mi Sphere 360 is on its way. Um, it came fairly quick. Ordered it on December 18th, and tomorrow I think is January 9th, so it's not too bad. It's about three weeks from Singapore, which is fairly normal. I see other people on uh, Facebook that ordered in November that still haven't gotten their camera but again they're not in the United States either so that could be part of the problem it may even be their local postal service that's causing issues that I don't know 
Um, if any of you know of a good case to put the Mi Sphere 360 in, please let me know. I have been looking at a, a Pelican, I think it's a Pelican Model 1200, which is a pretty substantial hard case. It's about $25 with the foam and all. It's uh, kind of on the big side for that camera, but uh, other people had mentioned the Pelican 1010, which was like 15 bucks. but once you add the like 10 or $15 to put foam in it, you're above the 1200 which is even a larger case, so... I think it's kind of silly to buy the smaller case. I'm even thinking of maybe custom cutting some foam and putting it in a headphone case such as such as sorry for giving you dead air such as this. This is a reasonably large case and I mean let's take the headphones out but as you can see Good size in there. It's got some mesh to hold cards or whatever. It's got a little rubber band here. I think if we put the little foam here, cut to the size of the cut to the size of the um, Xiaomi Mi Sphere 360, I think that would probably work good. I just have to go find some foam. I may even have some left over from other cameras like the one from my GoPro because you know they give you the foam that and it's all like I guess laser cut on the uh, to fit the GoPro and accessories and then I have one for the Samsung 360 again you cut take out the pieces so between those pieces and I actually have a large pelican case a large pelican hard case for uh, my film cameras and uh, that's full between the lenses and two cameras so you know I think I have some foam from that left over as well I was even thinking of using a possible the possibility of a pistol case because some of the pistol cases you know like for a Walter PPK they're fairly small about that big zip up nice cushion inside with a uh, nice uh, like velour inner and that's probably would work as well too although I don't think it would make it uh, crush proof so you'd have to be careful of crushing the lens what in the world is that here's your reminder for my pay computer stop oh boy it's reminding me to go to the headquarters in call of duty to get my pay which uh, you use to buy uniforms and emotes and different calling cards and so forth. And I'm trying to get uh, the Royal Highlanders uniform, which is a Canadian uniform for the, I think it's the Expeditionary Force. So I'm going to wrap it up here because it's really not much left to say. I'm mainly doing this as a test. No one may find this of any real interest. It's just me rambling. So, as always, have a great night from the Mad Mohawk, Guegue. Yes, that's how you pronounce it. K-W-E, K-W-E is Guegue. Have a great night from the Mad Mohawk, Guegue. Onagi, wahi! And we're out. Auf Wiedersehen. Bye-bye.